Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Keep going. Mm-hmm. One more time. Sorry, no. Mm-hmm. Perfect. All right. All right, I'll tell you when, when you're going to do it, you'll, but you'll kind of feel it. This chapter is called Song. I'm going to read just the beginning of it. We take steps heavy with loss, both sides of the chain depleted by one on the battleground. The eraser triplets reduced to twins, their third dispatched by the great raven ways. Ain't have no chance. The brothers had been confined together in the womb, in the cell, and finally in this open world of the killing games, now they're separate for the first time. The two that are left wet the swastikas on their neck with tears, and their third killed by a black man at that. On our side, we lost 80, a good man that done bad long time ago. Big, jovial man somehow, despite the blood on everything, not a bad fight, but not a good one either. Eighty hesitated for a moment, and in that moment, he found himself punctured in a way that could never be patched. Out on the circuit, after the loss, Razor looks at me as we step through, crunching the evidence of Spring's relent on our feet. He asking for a song. I don't got many remembrances memorized, I say. What you mean, Razor says. All that shit you sing around sound like memorial shit, so go ahead. I look at Bells, who walks head up, crying and quiet. I'll sing one if you ain't got one. All this goddamn singing the whole year, and now singer ain't got a song in him. Imagine that. That's fucked, bro. Give me a tune at least. I'll freestyle one for my bro, Razor says. A tune to hum comes to me immediately. I go, mm-hmm. perfect. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Keep it going. Mm-hmm. I see Razor taking it in. Mm-hmm. Closing his eyes, gripping the hilts of his weapon. Mm-hmm. When he was here in the living, 80 and Razor and Bells would rhyme the miles away, passing the bars back and forth between them. Today, Razor takes my sound in, breathes it through his body as we follow the anchor down a river I'll never know the name of. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He goes, mm-hmm. And raise it. I love my boy, a fat man. I loved him when he got thin. I know he done some wrong, but Lord, he gone. So please go and let him in. Mm-hmm. Bell's last. Another story of the name 80 is he was first called 800. But the way he thrust himself into work in his body after barely winning his first two fights, he lost two humans worth. Changed his name to fit his size. 80. Mm-hmm. And Bells takes it from him to the same tomb. Mm-hmm. She says, Reggie was a legend. Ride or die, sink or swim. He stood with me, and now he's free. So please, God, let him in. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I feel it passing through me, and I do not deny the spirit. Mm-hmm. His mom named him a king's name, because she knew what he had with him. His only sin was too human. So please, God, let him in. So please, Lord, let him in. So please, Lord, let him in.
<laughs> Good job, y'all. I'm very impressed with you, of all races. <laughs> Good job.